Old guy on stream. Chrono Trigger. <laughs> Funny. Let me join. Maybe my guy will come on screen. He will come on the screen. He always come on screen. Sorry. ADHD. Autistic. Bilingual chat. Jewish. You're just reading my tags on yeah, the stream right now. I, I love your tags. Thank you. You're welcome. So, uh, this is Chrono Trigger. I don't know if you guys are fans of Chrono Trigger. It's fun. Uh, I say you guys, but there are currently zero viewers. Uh, I'm here. I'm viewing. I'm I'm viewing. Hi, Jeremy. You're Hello. Daisy. I'm Daisy. Pull up your oh, chair. Yeah. Pull up your chair and play some goddamn Chrono Trigger. Make sure the controller doesn't get un unplugged. My Chrono is triggered. Hello, Juglius. How you doing? Oh, it's Joel. She triggered my PTSD uh, until I start. Fucking die. Does it work? No. I'm gonna kill myself. Please don't. Why? Uh, okay, cool. Would Press any not. key. Do a new game. Confirm talk. Cancel oh. walk. Okay. It's, it's Xbox order. Yeah. Got it. Uh, change the battle mode to not active. Because. Yeah, Got and it. change Got the it. graphics to original. I think, yeah. Okay. Yeah, funny right. enough, his name isn't Chrono, like the title. It's Chrono without an H. Yeah, yeah I was wondering renaming him. Yeah, do you want to? I mean, I, I sure, whatever. Give I guess the, for the main guy, yeah. Give me a name. Chrono. <laughs> Should I just spell it correctly? No, you can't. You can only use five characters. So it would just be Kron. Let's just name him Chrono. Kronk. <laughs> yeah, Kronk. Kronk trigger. Is that how you spell Kronk? Yeah. Okay. Germ. Germ. Maybe press enter. Cool. Wonderful. Wonderful. Is Kronk correct? correct? I don't know. He sure is. <laughs> I hope he's correct. Is he PC? That is what we're playing the game on. <laughs> hey, Dia, how you doing? Hi, Dia. You're a goose. I have the stream muted because I'm out, but hi, I hope you're well. Aw, cute. I would type that I am, but oh well. Yeah, they're bombing the city. So, yeah, I was gonna say. Just kidding, they're fireworks, there's a festival. Mario is sending his bullet bill back to Chrono Trigger Island. To Kronk. Kronk. Kronk! Kronk, Kronk are, are you, you still, still sleeping? sleeping? I don't hey, know. Bob, I'm fucking sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to get up. Yeah, we're gonna have to read everything, because I just realized, like, <laughs> no one will be able to with Why? the fucking characters oh, walking oh, around. Oh. Dear me, I forgot how beautiful Leon's belt. Also, we don't have to read everything; just yeah, stuff yeah, that's it's... necessary. Like, yeah, if you're trying to watch this for the plot, you you are sorely mistaken. <laughs> the millennial. <figure>. <laughs> <laughs> that's... <laughs> That really caught me on guard. <laughs> the last time I played this game, I didn't even know that word. Like, <laughs> off to a great start. Come on now. Out of bed with you. I like the little cat he has. That's a cat. It's a uh, either that or like a fox, I guess. <laughs> he goes. Ooh. Can I like interact with shit? Yeah, I think there'll be an exclamation on top of your head if you can. Okay. Looks like I can't. Hello? It's about time. By the way, you're going to go see... Oh dear, what was her name? That young adventurous friend of yours? That's Luca. Um, I'm fine with canon names for everyone else. I don't know. <laughs> just Kronk? Okay. Yeah, just because like I want to like know... Because I know Chrono's name, but like the later everyone characters, I don't like... know their names. So like, I kind of want to just know them. Right, cool. That's right. Luca, you're going to stop by and see her new invention at the fair, aren't you? Plus, Chrono is probably silent, so it won't matter as much what his name is. Oh, he doesn't talk? I'm assuming, just because this is a fucking RPG. Okay. But he he might. I don't know, it's been a while since I played. Oh, I went! I can make, I can make my cat exclaim or something. It's a jump. very tiny noise, but it is there. Oh, there's a noise? Yeah, it's like... Oh, it's, I need to hear that. It's very subtle. Uh, what am I, what am I doing? Oh, I'm, oh I almost I'm forgot. Here. Here's your allowance. Oh, hell yeah! You have obtained 200 G. 200,000, dude. Where is she? Lean Square. Hello? Today is the 1,000th anniversary of our kingdom's foundation. Enjoy the festivities. I surely would if I were your age. You can still now. What? This guy looks awesome. This guy looks saucy. 
I don't think you can talk to him. There's no exclamation point. Oop. Hello. Pancake. No. Athenian water. How do you pronounce that? Pan. I don't know. That's why I always say pancake as a joke to All avoid right. the fact that I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> I just told you. <laughs> shelter. Uh, I'll, I... Dude, you can buy a shelter for $150. No fucking way. I like three. Yeah, that's, that's good. See, this starts uh, like a normal walk. like JRPG, yeah. but it's got like a lot of cool twists and turns that I Whoa. just think are very neat. But I like this little fair. Whoa! Oh my god! It's me, Wall Man. Welcome to Norstein Beckler's Tent of Horrors. Thanks. The spine this doesn't look like a tent. Thank you. It's it's <laughs> nice to be here. This doesn't really look like a tent. This is more so a. Uh... Well, I surely am horrified. How many silver points would you like to spend? I don't know. <laughs> just just came to look. <laughs> What's what, in what, there? What are silver points? I don't know. I've never seen this before. <laughs> okay, then I'll spend ten. I'll spend ten silver. Do you points. have any? I don't know. Welcome to Norstein Beckler's Tent of Whores. Thanks. Tent of Not a tent. bitches and hoes. <laughs> you probably don't have any. You don't have enough points. Yeah, you probably gotta get them like in the fair or whatever. This dude looks like the um, yeah. Jalhalla from Wind Waker. Yeah. He looks like Jif. Hella Jif. Is that a Homestuck reference? Yeah. I love Homestuck. Whoa, excuse Ooh. me. I, I, I went next to you, and then we both collided somehow. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah, is that right? Dead. <laughs> I'm so sorry, are you okay? Uh-oh, my pendant. Oh, it's right there, go get it. Erm, um, what the spruce? What the scale is? There some, oh, I thought I was in a cutscene. Uh, <laughs> oh, I have to go retrieve it for her. Excuse me, miss. Ah! Oh, thank oh! goodness, my pendant. I know it doesn't look like much, but I want you to have my tunnel snake's jacket. <laughs> <laughs> May I have... Oh, okay. I have to... <laughs> I have to give it yes. back. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> you must live in this town. I came to see the fair. Awfully boring wandering around alone, though, isn't it? Hey, why don't we walk around together for a while? Wouldn't that be great? Sure. <laughs> oh my god! Yahoo! I really like that animation. Like I like yeah, the little, that was like, cute. Yeah. I never told you my name, did I? It's uh um Meryl. Is that how you pronounce it? I I, I assume. Some people might say Marley. 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 Okay, a lot of people pronounce the Pokemon Meryl, but I pronounce the Pokemon M. The, there's a Pokemon spelled M A R I L L, but I always called it Meryl. Meryl, I do like that. Yeah. Because this is Meryl. She's cool. I like her animation, how she jumps. Yeah, she's really point. excited. I like how her like, hands are behind her back. Nice you got points. no silver yeah, points. I, I don't know what that Dumbass. is. Dumbass. Oh, I could buy it? That's a lot of gold, but okay. Sorry, you don't have enough. Oh, he's saying you can exchange them for money. Oh, can I do the opposite? Uh, I don't know. You probably have to like play games or something. Oh, ho, ho, ho. So have you heard the gossip? That's, in that's no. embarrassingly vague. <laughs> Well, just between us, I heard that the king is tearing his hair out over his tomboy of a daughter. Holy shit! Okay, asshole. Just once, I'd like to meet her and see how wild she really- Jesus Christ! Okay, everyone in this game sucks now? Uh, do I have to talk to these bozos? Preparations are still underway. Enjoy yourself in the square for a while and check back a little later. Ooh. Wait, what was over there? Why are you doing gulp sounds? I do that all the time. You're funny. <laughs> Drinking contest. Step right up. Press A as fast as you can. There's no drinks on the table. <laughs> yeah, it's a very it's like difficult. Contest. I didn't agree to this. How old is Chrono? <laughs> what if you were just pressing the wrong button? I think I am. No, that's A on but it, Xbox. But it's oh okay. Yeah, it's just mislabeled on this controller. Got it. Uh, so what did I win? Sniffle sub. Kitter in. I don't know. You skipped the the actual oh, dialogue. I think it said you got I'll silver points. Again. Drinking Drinking contest. Contest. Dude! I'll do it again. How old is Chrono? <laughs> oh, he's good, he's good. Maybe it's just water. Yeah, maybe it's brown, like orange water. Yeah, the water was really unclean back then. Like my cock. Not, Not bad. bad. I'll put five silver points on your yes, card. So I can just farm it? You're awfully competitive, aren't you, Kronk? <laughs> I forgot his <laughs> name was Kronk. Uh, well, I'm assuming the silver points aren't like anything crazy. They're just for this carnival. Yeah. Yeah. So like you can farm it, but like the same way you can farm money in an yeah. RPG. Who the fuck oh, are you? Shit, what's going on? Well, I like this guy on the Adam and Eve. Yeah, that's what they looked like. Oh, prehistoric rhythm. All right. What do you have to say about that? Oh, post-historic rhythm. 
Damn. Oh, wow, I wonder if this game is about time travel or something. Do it. I don't know. Press Y and X. Oh, no, it doesn't. I don't know. Does it just work? Uh. <laughs> That's a good <laughs> dance. That's a great dance. I call it laughing Whoa. personally. Oh, it just your character's a moat. That's a great emote. Sometimes I just climb. <laughs> can you do that anywhere in the game? I don't remember oh, that being be a really thing. Oh, that would be really cute. Hold on. Yeah, just leave and see if you can still do it. No, it's only in that area. What a weird future. Uh, yeah, it was, I like it. It was cute. I like it. It is cute. <laughs> My dear I old wife. <laughs> My dear old wife made the bat lunch for me. It's like I'm gonna change the volume real quick so your controller might not work. Okay. I just want to make sure people can hear the game. Let me know, guys, if you can hear the game good. Oh, and if it's too loud or too quiet. To My dear old wife made that lunch for me. Always the highlight of my day, giving me that extra oomph when I'm starting to feel worn down. I think you could just like leave during conversation. Yeah, you can hear it better now, right? Yeah, you can. Go straight. If you want to try your hand against Luca's bipedal robot battler Gatto, you can win silver points if you beat him. Sure, let's fuck. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's Luca's That's... robotic battler, Gatto. They call me Gatto. I have metal joints. If you can beat me up, you'll earn 15 points. All right. He has a Pokeball on his chest. <laughs> so he does. So he. Holy shit! Um, Attack. I, I, wait, I guess so I could choose? Between yeah, two. basically when their meter fills up, the little yellow meter on the bottom, that means it's their turn. So it's not technically turn-based because like the enemy can still go while you're choosing. Oh, I don't like that. It's active time battle. Like but what, no, so like when you're picking something like an item or a tech time freezes. Yeah. So like it is fine. You just got to like remember to go, you know? Okay, okay. Yeah. Like when you're in menus and stuff, like picking like attacks, Anything okay. that isn't a basic attack, like time will freeze. Gotcha. Don't worry. Okay. It's a, it's an interesting battle I'm, system. I'm getting fucked. Yeah. Oh, this fucking spam attack. Oh my gosh. Uh oh. Alright, maybe. Oh. oh okay. You did it. Yeah. You're in 10 experience. You earned one toilet paper. What is. I earned one Twilight Princess. Yeah, one tapestry. We could go on for hours with that. Oh no, I have lost. It seems you have won. Here are your fucking points. Now, wasn't that fun? Yes. Yeah, that was yes, loads Gato. of fun. Bring it! Bring it! Okay. Cool. Now, where's where's the actual progress? Yeah, where's... Uh, I like that balloon down there. Oh, yeah, it looks like a little <laughs> Mickey. It reminds me of the baby Bowser balloons from uh, Bowser from Mario balloons. Sunshine. Yeah, yeah. yeah, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Mickey Mouse. What the fuck is this shit? What the fuck is this shit? What is this shit? Line up the with the bell. bell. Press the, the button, button when you're ready. Judge your distance carefully, then press A once more. Sure thing. Is this the button? No, that's a pot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That was a load of horse shit. What am I... <laughs> Wait, what am I supposed to? Am I supposed to like hit, like mash it? No, I think you're supposed to just like not hit it when you're closest. You gotta find the sweet spot. Oh, oh yeah, you're right. Oh, when you're the furthest. furthest. Okay, my bad. Okay, yeah, when you're the furthest. You can be further. Come on. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. Just like wait to oh, see yeah, how yeah. far it can get. Then do it. Oh. Ooh, you suck. Nice! You did it. Way to go. I'll put one silver point on your card. You how does that work? We don't have technology. Oh, this is do. Chrono Trigor. Uh, these runners are busy racing, so they won't answer you if you talk to them. Oh, I reckon, I reckon. I, I reckon, I reckon. I reckon, I reckon. Oh, I'm gonna go back to the scary tent. Okay. The little shop of horrors or yeah. whatever? <laughs> Welcome to the fucking funny funny. So, I don't even know what he's offering. How many silver points would you like to spend? Oh, ten. I only have ten. Oh, okay, hi. Hello, I'm really <laughs> scary. Like, what? I'm Biggs. I'm Wedge. I'm Piet. Is, is that so? Nice to meet you guys. Pretty I'm scary. Anyway, uh... What the hell? Oh, are we supposed to find out who's who? Which one is Wedge? Uh, there's no way. I mean, they were just clipping into each other. It's just a guessing game. The left one, I don't fucking know. I'm wet. See? Called it. Oh, you got me. What it's a Poyozo doll. It'll spruce up your room. 
What a game. That was a hard. That was cool. a very scary. Let's find how. Out. Let's find out how to progress. Who's that alien? I don't know, but I I I would I don't even want to know. Honestly. All right, let's try going north again. I guess that's probably where we're supposed to go. Yeah, like m figure out like how to get past them. I don't know. Maybe you have to play one mini game and then they leave. I don't I don't fucking know. What's up, boy? Preparations are still underway. Where are you in the square? Is this the square? No. Talk I think to the that. Square's the sound. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure. I was over here, right? That's what it was. Over here. Oh, he's following me now. Oh wow. Hello. <laughs> I like that he's following you, but like not like a party yeah, member. Yeah, like he's yeah. not perfect at it. That's really cute. <laughs> Come with me. We'll adventure together. Yeah, I'm not sure where else to go. Cause you already did the drinking. God, I don't want to do the drinking guys this time again. I want the game to be fun. Uh, it's so much fun. I'm sussy. I'm sussy. Not bad. I'll put five fucking points on your fucking cards. <laughs> You're awfully competitive, aren't you, Kronk? You're awful. You're fucking horrible. Wait, is there something north? Uh, I was do? right up there. But I don't remember what was up there. Yeah, about. I don't remember being there. Oh, um, yeah, the dancing. Okay, let's leave. Where else is there to go? I don't know. Maybe the square is further south. Like, maybe there's, like, other That's places on the map. No, no, no. Like, go oh, further. Because, uh, like, we there's a world map. Maybe we can find the square. Also, talk to that guy. Talk to the old man in the middle. Yeah, this is the square. Okay, now we know. Talk to old man in the middle. Today is the fucking funny... Talk to the fountain. Oh, is that her? I think that's I hear totally Luca her. and her father have put together a crazy contraption. I hope it doesn't blow up again. They ought to be ready by now. Oh, okay, cool. Wait, really? Cool, yeah. That's this. Yeah, we had to I talk to them. To that's RPGs for you, baby. See, they're ready now. Easy. Just a minute. I want to get some candy. Uh, who are you? <laughs> it's Meryl. Um. Wait! Give me a second to choose! Hey! You're so impatient. Why are you- What like, am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to just, like, literally wait? She told you to wait to pick candy. She's a woman, for God's sake. Sure, young miss. I'm just saying, like, let the fucking women, like, she, she's a person. She's a human being. I didn't- well, it's a video game. I didn't think I'd actually have to wait. Yeah, well, she told you to wait, so, uh, maybe stop being a fucking dumbass. Tabam, step right up, arm me any with time and the courage. I first ever upper dimensional transporters to venture to the century. Look, that's Luca. It's fucking half like two. I guess so. With the way you walk around and people talk. Uh, was that what you were referring to? No, it was like a teleporter thing. What, uh, what is he saying? Give it a try, create it. Oh, it's you, Kronk. Talk to Luca. I just did. No, you were her dad was talking. Kronk! Kronk! I was expecting to wonder when you show up. No one wants to try my teleporter. Would you be so kind? Yes! Oh, this will be fun. I'll watch while you try it out. Just hop up, 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 up into the left pod. The left pod, the brown brick. She got a turtle shell on her head. Yeah. System activated. <laughs> He's, He's breaking it, it with a hammer. He's missing it. He's hitting the ground. He misses it so much. Initiating energy transfer. Holy shit. Wow, they did it. Yeah! Ooh! Ooh. Ow! Amazing! <laughs> I know, right? So, how was it? Wanna try it again? Yes. Yeah, do it again. Cis gender. Uh, 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 uh. Initiating energy transfer. Wow, that sure was fun. Ooh, amazing. It's even better the second time! I might have tried a second time! <laughs> it worked. Unbelievable. They never. Ahem! As I was saying, Luca has done it again, ladies and gentlemen. A thrilling display of science at its best. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the opportunity. That looks like fun. I want to try it too. Huh? Huh? Hey. Oh. Kronk, when did you manage to pick up a cutie like her? Well, well, you see, I... <laughs> George, they're on to us! <laughs> uh, it's alright, isn't it, Kronk? Just wait here, don't run up without me. Behold, ladies and gentlemen, as this vision of loveliness steps aboard the machine. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay, I'll be right back. You're sure about this? There's still time to change your mind? Why are you- Why, yeah. No way, I'm not afraid. Like, what's- <laughs> Why would you say that? It worked like three times for Chrono. I mean, Kronk. Let's give her a great big hand. 
I'm here. Have you seen Illumination Super Mario Bros. yet? Yes, I have. I saw it we twice. Just, we just saw it like we just saw it together, ago. and I saw it on Wednesday. It was really good. Yeah, we Much it. better than I was expecting. Initiating energy transfer. I have a feeling this isn't gonna go as planned. Oh, is that the locket you picked up for her? Oh, oh the pendant, yeah. Whoa! Whoa! Holy oh. shit! Ooh. Oh wow! Hey, Nick, how you doing? Hi, Nick. Hey, it's Nick. I know Nick. Yeah, me too. Nick, we're playing Chrono Trigger. You like this game, right? Gemery. You gotta get it. <laughs> Nick, who's your character? Is that Tingle? No I, fucking way. I can't see it from here. Did it just auto give him Tingle? Yeah, this Tingle. Luca, she's not reappearing. Thing, Thinble. It's the new Tears of the Kingdom trailer sold in the game. Yeah, it finally looks. It looks like looks way more like a Zelda game than yeah, um, Breath of the Wild. I'm, it, I'm pretty excited. It, it satisfied me more. Yeah, like it looks like it has unique bosses and enemies and environments. Also, it has a mushroom town, so cute. Uh, it couldn't be the telepod. The way that rift appeared, the way her pendant seemed to be reacting to it, something else must have caused it all. That guy looks really funny. Yeah, you're right. I just... So, I just started envisioning his neck as teeth. And now I, like, can't unsee it. I can't see it. Like, like these two white dots are teeth. Like his, like, like buck teeth. Oh, yeah, and like, like that, like, black line is, like, his mouth. Yeah, like, oh. like he has, like, a weird, like, Donkey Kong mouth. <laughs> yeah. Thoughts on Matt Mercer being Ganondorf? I fucking love it. I'm so happy. Uh, I, I have no opinion on Matt Mercer being Ganondorf. Uh... He sounds nice. Yeah, he sounds great. Yeah. Apparently he um he in played his... it in he played it in like there will be brawl or whatever. Yeah, something like that. I don't I don't yeah. know. He had like old shorts where he played as Ganondorf and yeah. now he's actually Ganondorf. Cronk. Oh, you're going after her? What a fine lad. It's the only way. I don't know where that hole leads, but we got no other choice. Turn yourself in, Will. It's the only <laughs> way. <laughs> I think he's a cop. <laughs> yeah, Ganondorf is like my Probably one of my favorite. So is he a cop? Ganondorf's like one of my favorite Zelda characters, like ever. Yeah, I was I just like, so much. I was like reflecting on that, like seeing the new Ganondorf design. Like, yeah, he's been in like what, like five games. No, he, he hasn't is been very in a lot. infrequent. Yeah, like he was. He's. What's crazy is he's mentioned in two games that he doesn't appear in. Yeah, he's, he was in. He was. He was mentioned. He was supposed to be in a Link to the Past, but then they were just like, nah, fuck that. Really? Because he's mentioned so. in Link to the Past. Because like he didn't exist yet. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the, there, there, there there's there's like, an unused concept art of him in for the Oracle games, I think. There's yes, concept yeah. art of him. Yeah, but he yeah, he's, awesome. he's also mentioned by name in uh, Four Swords Adventures. Yeah, and actually, Four Swords Adventures is the Ganon. yeah is the only game that has a different Ganon. I don't like that. I wish I it was always the, I wish it was always the same Ganon. I mean, like when we were talking about Canon Zelda games, Four Swords Adventures is definitely the least one. Yeah. Yeah, Hyrule looks weird in that one. Hyrule's like cool. on an island. The three of us have to hang out soon. I completely agree, Nick. Yeah, I miss you. Maybe we could stream together. Yeah, I would love that. Only if you're comfortable with it, though. But I would love to have you on stream, Nick. You're cool. Whoa. Whoa. Earthbound. This sure does look like Earthbound. <laughs> A better game on the Super Nintendo. Huge Earthbound fan excited to play it for the first time. Truth. <laughs> Circle. Okay, so now like the actual game has started. Okay. Yeah. Uh, are there random encounters in this? Nope. Love and it. Th Love this was it. the. These was this was like really one of the first games where like there was no, <laughs> like the first RPG where there's like no. Di oh, you should use an item immediately. Okay. Yeah. Wait, that's tech item. Potion. Potion. Me. But yeah, this was yeah! like one of the first games where like the transition between like overworld and battle was just completely seamless. I fucking love it. Yeah, you see, like, enemies freeze, like, Whoa. small things happen, so there's, like, time to, like, when you're, like, in the menus, like, picking, like, text and stuff, you'll, you'll be fine. So that, but, like, that, this part, while you're selecting an enemy, like, they still can go. So that bottom bar, that's how much time I have in between my turns? Yeah, like, when it fills up, oh. then it's your turn. Okay. That's when you can go. That's the hell right? Yeah. Anyway, I just this is just how three brain men. This is just how every Final Fantasy game after three plays as okay. well. Well, I guess after three and before, like, what, 13? Because yeah. Final Fantasy isn't even an RPG anymore. It's kind of stupid. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's called ATB, Active Time Battle. 
But yeah, I, I think Die. it's neat. I really love when RPGs don't have random encounters. I like uh, me too. I like because I I like battling in RPGs, but like sometimes I just need to get the fuck out of there and I want to run yeah, around the yeah. enemies. I, I also just like enjoying my surroundings without having to stress yeah. about oh if I walk too far a fucking enemy might hurt me. Yeah, it gets a little. Silly. Also like the good music playing. Yeah, Square yeah. Enix does HD 2D remakes of both this and Mario Luigi, Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. God damn, Mario RPG would be fucking awesome. Power glove. Gotta equip that. Uh, Equippy. Equipment is at top. Hide cat. Um, what is it? Power glove. Okay, Jay replaces the headband. Cool. So our speed went down, but our success went up. Cool. <laughs> this is this was literally in a link to the past. Oh yeah. Are you go in the dark world. Did you see that fucking gif of Jack Black like throwing the peach like to himself? No. So like basically they made like a music video for Peaches where Dra Jack Black is like has like red hair and a green suit to look like Bowser yeah. And th th there's this shot of him throwing a peach and like they just mirrored it and played it backwards uh -huh. So it's just like him playing catch with himself And it's just like someone tweeted in like me and my clone like playing catch or whatever me and my twin playing catch uh -huh. And then someone quote tweeted it and wrote those two MFs in East Clock Town <laughs> And I fucking <laughs> lost it Yeah. Use. No, 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 no. Uh, oh, okay. It's like left and right there. You see. You should probably use the D-pad for menus. It's probably easier. Probably. Symbols, potion, go. Kronk. Hey, Goose Go. Ah, uh, the boys in the guild. Goose Go. Boys in the guild. Goose Go. Uh, you can hold a uh, circle or. Oh, okay. It's it's a toggle. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, this song is so good. Where the fuck am I? Well, Where you're in the same place, but. That map was the same. So you've a mind to buy some weapons and join in the fight against the Fiend Lord's army, have you? I, I, yeah. Wonderful. Sure. Yeah, I said all that. <laughs> Remember to equip the weapons you buy. Not much meaning otherwise. Thanks, mister. You didn't come all this way to look, did you? Surely there's something you'd like to buy. Pea shooter. Uh, I have. Chrono can't equip the pea shooter, see? If he okay. does the stance, I believe that means, yeah. So this increases my attack, I see. Hmm, yeah. of course. Uh, oh, great I'll, heavens! Oh, good heavens! I'll buy a pancake. I'll buy two pancakes, actually. Athenian water. This revives not that ally. Mm, I don't have any allies at the moment. Damn, no allies. And also, I want this. So. Cool. And yeah. you could also. Oh, go back to equip. Like, press B. You can just equip them in this same menu. Sweet. Useful. And then you can sell your wooden sword. Oh, wonderful. Okay. Sell. Wooden sword. One. Wonderful. Nice. Buy. You can get the vest or the helm. Yeah, I'll probably get the vest. We'll do the same. I'll get the vest. And make sure to equip it. <laughs> Kronk. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's what Kronk sounds like. Exactly. The poison sell. from Kronk. Hide tunic. Hide it. Get the, get, get My it, thanks. Yeah. Do come. Erm. Um, Erm. Um. Wait, there was a fucking chest in there. Yeah, but I, it might have just been a cosmetic thing. <gasps> Dragon Quest did that a lot, and this was like co created by the creator of Dragon Quest. Residence. It's basically. Residence. Is it residence? Yeah, it's yeah, like a okay. home you can go visit. Look at this guy. He, he looks kind of familiar. Look at that floating bell. Yeah, I like that. It's like. Oh, yeah, this I'm is the same guy, to the it? village blacksmith. Uh, uh, I'm forging this bell at the queen, the king's behest, I'm as a symbol of his love for Queen Lean. <laughs> the queen's vanishing act had me wondering if all this work would be for naught. After all, what's the bell without the queen, eh? But it seems they found her in the canyon up north. She's back at the castle now, and I'm back to work. I see. Well, miss. My husband wants a daughter, both clever and fair. True. Can't we I rem Yeah. I want a daughter, clever and fair. I like I like my stupid face here. Yeah, I like Corona's little dumb yeah. face. Dumb stupid fucking face. Where am I going? Mm -hmm. not, not many places to go. Look at my hips. My hips don't lie. Okay, I'll look at your hips. Wow, that's really wow, pretty. Wow, okay. Holy, holy shit. The Fiend Lord. Of, you, you know, the Octopath sprites kind of just look like this game's yeah. sprites. Never really realized that. Uh, Sir Cyrus, the Octopath character, we must see to the Kingdom's wow. defense as well. I wonder if the company that made this game made Octopath Traveler. Do, 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 do. 
Alright. This game has a sequel. Like, everyone begs for a Chrono Trigger sequel, but it has one. But apparently a lot of people don't like it just because it's pretty different. It mm. seems cool to me. You haven't played it? Nah. I, I've never beaten Chrono Trigger. No. Where are you, you say? You some sort of simp? Even a half-wit should know this is the land for Guardia. Our kingdom wages war with the Fiend Lord's army day and night, fighting to restore the realm's peace. What the hell are you saying Pray tell to us me? you knew that much at least. No. Of course. <laughs> no. Then might you show the good grace to stop wandering about pestering folk with moronic questions? I didn't ask you a question, you fuckface. I walked up to you and you started yelling. Yeah, he just assumed you were some idiot. Like, the rooms are ten gold for the night. Will you be staying? Oh. No, no, <laughs> I know. The answer is probably no. Fair? Have you gone mad? This is no time for mirth and mummery. Why is everyone being an everyone asshole? Everyone hates me. Oh, praise be. They found Queen Lean wandering up <laughs> in the canyon. She's been missing for so long. I'd feared the worst. Is Queen Lean the, the girl that went missing? I know her name's not Lean. I know, know her name is fucking Marley and me. But... <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not, I don't remember. Oh, sir. I think our hearts are all a little more at ease now. When Queen Lean disappeared, it was all the king could think of. He thought of the Fiend Lord's doing and dispatched the soldiers to the four corners of the realm to find her. But she's been found and that's all that matters. Yes, master. Hello, sir. The Fiend Lord's army laid waste to the Zenon Bridge. We've lost our only fucking funny. I don't okay, cool. know how to fix that bridge. Huh? That's, you probably can't. My guess is to go to that castle or that thing to the left of the castle. How do I even get to the castle? You just walk through. The, you see the dark part? Yeah. Ooh, ooh, this music's so good. Hmm. Eat spicy goodness? Like a bouse. What the fuck? Damn, I guess there are kind of... Oh, you press the fast forward button oh, by accident. Yeah. How do you turn that off? I don't know. Basically, it's auto battle. Uh, oh, can yeah, you press select? Can you press oh, R? Just kill these guys? Yeah. Okay. But we should probably figure out how to disable that. You got a pancake. I'm assuming it's just like something in the... By the way, shout out to B-Void. They're playing a Spirit Terror Farewell Edition. Uh, no, it's fine. J Oops. Jesus fucking Christ. Right. Well, actually, um... Oh, uh, you, you can change the battle speed, actually. Like, if it's, like, overwhelming for you, you can make it slower. Because, oh. you know, the, mo the things will fill up, like, I'll slower. Do so you have, like, more time to think. Okay, I'll do slower then. Cool. This seems good. Battle mode? Is that what I'm supposed to do? No. J just... J we'll figure it out during the next battle. Do you want to play a little bit? Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay. Movement oh, run. Shit. Oh, don't quit the game. <laughs> that would be bad. Ooh. Sorry. That's okay, I love you. <laughs> There's something to the left? No. Mm. Ooh. Oh, it's a little guy. The enemy dropped a shelter. <laughs> okay. Hey, look at that. Obtained strength capsule. I'm assuming that's the seeds like Final Fantasy based on, or from uh, Dragon Quest, based on how they described it. Mm -hmm. Permanently raises strength by one. Yeah, let's just use it on Chrono. Why not? I mean, Croc. I'm sorry, guys. Ah! Okay, I pressed. Okay, it's it's uh, the top button. It's it's this. Oh, okay. I definitely cool. actually pressed that. Yeah, earn 10 AXP. Yeah, it's just a toggle. If an enemy is super easy and you know you're gonna win, you can just press that. It'll fast forward right. and auto battle. Uh, where are we going? Oh yeah, I guess I was playing. Should I just do this part? Yeah, or... sure. Cool. Just pay attention so you know what to do when you pick it up back up. Dumbass. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, uh, enemies. Uh... Oh, cool, they're riding on the ball, guys. All right, now I'm going to do tech. Yeah, you see, when I'm picking, like, which technique to use, they're, they're stuck. They mm. don't move. Okay, Cyclone. So this game, actually, like, the position of the enemies, like, is important. Like, if there were enemies near him, I would have hit those, too. With that move. Oh. It's, it's, it's something you just learn yeah, by, yeah. like, playing. Yeah. Earn four TP. Oh yeah, let me see. I think the TP is like you can like unlock new techs here or something. Mm -hmm. TP needed seventy three. How much do I have? 
Okay, so you like you can like spend money on new skills or spend points on skills. Kind of also like Octopath, doesn't okay. it? Octopath that bit. Uh, Spending like like uh, like job points on skills. I don't think so. Maybe it does. I don't know. It's like passive skills or no? I think both. Yeah. I'm not too sure. Damn. Okay, that was easy. Let's go to the castle. Holt, who goes there? I've not seen your face before in those outlandish clothes. You wouldn't be one of the Fiend Lord's agents, would we? Ha! Fat chance, look at him. The boy's not built to lift a sword, let alone serve in the Fiend Lord's army. Okay, dick. Suppose you're right. Now run along, boy, before we're forced to lock you up in the towers. What? Stop that at once. I don't know why I did that when it said woman's voice. <laughs> I don't know. Wow, it's is Meryl, just like you said. Oh, wow. That man is my friend and you will treat him as such. But, your majesty, there's something strange about his look. Well, that's just racist. That's just mean. You think just someone's because someone's different, you can call them an alien? I guess that means old kid's an alien, too. Uh, no, I forgive me, my lady. Please enter. <laughs> Michael Jackson. <laughs> what do you have to say? I envy you to be favored by the queen. Hey, she hired you, didn't she? Come on. Look on the bright side. I like that guy. <laughs> Chancellor. Hmm. His ears are huge. Oh, okay. Da what, if, what if you just walked up to a guy and you were like, hey, and he just went, hmm, and then left the room? <laughs> like, I am to understand that you played some role in helping rescue my lady wife. Does he have a man wife? Uh, because the king is more important than the queen, I guess. We live in a very, very patriarchal society. Yeah, I don't like that. My lady wife. Might you know what befell Lean? She's been acting rather oddly since her return. She seems to have lost the coral hairpin she always wore. She always treasured that thing, so. Forgive me, you must be tired. Please rest in the knight's quarters down the stairs to the left. I'll speak to the commander. Okay, where I go sleep. Wow, the night's quarters. Would you like to rest? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I would. Scary looking guy. <laughs> it must hold about that. Uh, your queen's, your queen's friend, are you not? Take them. Talk to the maid if you need to rest. Take the maid if you take need her. to. Just <laughs> take her. Take my wife, please. Take my wife. The dining hall is below. The master of kitchens has a foul temper. Best stay out of his way unless you fancy a tongue lashing. I'm gonna go see him, he sounds cool. Oh There's god, yeah, is, is, he, is, he did he talk to the master of kitchens? I'm dying. Jesus. I'm dying of hunger. Holy shit, okay. Then why, like, you're, you're in the kitchen. kitchen, yeah. Your meal is ready. Oh! Yes! Poggers! Poggers. Poggers! The master of kitchens has earned his post. His cooking is worthy of at least three stars. At it's least. It's not a lot. Yeah, that's pretty bad. And the Fiend Lord's troops had better watch out for us. So, you and her majesty, the queen, are acquainted. I suppose so. The kitchen is a battlefield in its own right. She watched me nearly drink myself to death, so I guess <laughs> Have that... you watched to come... Have you come to season my broth with your lack of culinary expertise? Out! Oh, what in the name of all that's good is this ice cream that Her <laughs> Majesty so wishes I prepare? Stupid. I like that. Oh, this was treasure. Obtained ether. Who are you? Hello, sir. Um, you guys gonna say anything? Or... Yeah, can I help you? Where is our food and drink? Oh, Commander, beg pardons. It's not quite ready. Where is our food and drink? My men and I risk our lives in this war. Is it so much to ask that you keep us fed quickly now? Master of Kitchens, enough of your self-righteous ranting. You knights aren't the only ones putting your lives on the line for this kingdom. Humph, I think I've lost my appetite. I've no stomach for meat braised in cowardice. See that my men are fed. Thank you, Donkey Kong. <laughs> Jeremy always picks up my Donkey Kong plush and plays with it whenever he comes over. He just made it give me a thumbs up. Because one of his hands is just like his thumb is up. Oh yeah, the thumb is not stitched on anymore. Uh, go find someone else to command. I don't need you telling me how to do my fucking job. Bitch. 
Aw, oh, Donkey Kong gave a thumbs up. Donkey Kong goes... <coughs> cool, let's go see Queen Lean, I guess. That's not the queen. That's not the... Ooh, treasure! Obtain Poteon. Mom used to make fun of me for calling for pronouncing it Patian. <laughs> you pronounced it Patian? Yeah. That's adorable. How old were you? Uh fucking. Oh, this was last year. We were like seven. Oh. Seven, eight. I was cutie. playing Ocarina of Time and I went to the potion shop in Cockrico Village and I called it the Patian shop and she was like, That's not called that and I was like, but it's spelled that way. That's the voices in the Mario movie. Best, worst, how did either Chris Pratt or Seth Rogen do? Uh Chris Pratt was surprisingly good. I didn't have a problem with his Mario voice. Uh Charlie Day just fits Luigi so well. Yeah, they were all great. Um, honestly, I feel like Charlie Day would have been a better fit for Toad, though. Uh, I didn't enough. like Toad, no. Yeah, King and Michael Key, like, did not, say, like, Toad didn't feel like Toad to me. He felt like the Toad from the old cartoons, but not like Toad. Yeah. Seth Rogen, I think, was great as Donkey Kong. Jack yeah. Black was great. Anya Taylor-Joy was great. Um, who voiced Cranky Kong? I, like, his voice was very, like, not what I was expecting, because I'm so used to the Donkey Kong cartoon, but... Like he, his delivery for for Cranky Kong was like perfect. Mm -hmm. He was he was like such an asshole about it, and <laughs> it, it, it's just that is Cranky Kong's whole character is just I am a little like bitch. <laughs> I loved it. Uh, that being said, uh, despite uh, his voice being a little worse than the cartoon, Donkey Kong's voice is way better than the Donkey Kong cartoon. Jeremy, you ever watched the Donkey Kong cartoon? I've seen clips of it. You've, seen, you've heard his voice in it, right? Yeah, He's like, like I don't know what's happening to me. He's just like this like soul singer. It's like crazy. <laughs> he he fooled you, didn't I, Kronk? No, not particularly. It's me, but everyone keeps calling me lean for some reason. Also, what voice actor do you want to be redacted from the post credits? Um, I don't expect that character to have a voice because, you know, they, they don't talk. Uh, we yeah. were only together for that short time at the fair, but somehow I knew you'd come for me. I don't want that character to even have a movie <laughs> i'll be real yeah i mean like i wouldn't want that character to be the focus of the movie i mean like yeah be i was very <laughs> underwhelmed by the post credit scene like i was just like this feels like it was made by an ai uh-huh what's happening oh yeah this is happening the room turned green i feel like i'm being torn apart yeah that's me you don't look like you're being torn apart help me cronk i'm scared it's like i'm dying please cronk help Oh my god, okay. <laughs> Did he do like a drop kick on her? Like yeah, that pose was off. really weird. Ooh, ooh, he looks both ways. Cool. Well, the queen is gone and I'm the only one left. I'm sure they're gonna be very happy about that. Her Majesty's dismissed you already? You didn't engage in any untoward Ew! <laughs> well, yes. I fucked her. Oh my, speak of this to no one, or there will be terrible consequences. I've not heard a thing. Griffith. Yeah, and Wario and Luigi would have been a better post credits than that. Oh, that would have been I, sick. I, that's what I thought was going to happen. Oh no. If I, because I was hyping up to you that the post, like, that the post credits thing was, like, bad. I wouldn't have said that if it was Wario. I yeah. would have liked it by default. You're okay. Did you find the girl? No. Nah. Oh, Luca's, Luca came oh, with what? me. Okay. She, what? She disappeared. My whole fucking monitor shook. Uh, it's just as I thought then. I knew I recognized her from somewhere. I like Lucas. So like, we're not design. in like a different world right now. We're like just we just teleported somewhere else. I guess we'll find out. They must have mistaken that girl for her ancestor. Okay, I think we got our answer. Okay. We didn't travel through space. We traveled through time. Uh, okay. Okay. Kind of kind of explains the title of the game now, yeah. huh? And why the title screen has that like pendulum. Got it. Yeah. Okay. After all, that girl was our princess Nadia. Oh shit, it was? <laughs> oh yeah, remember they mentioned the tomboy prince? Oh, that's right. Yeah, her. yeah, it was Meryl. That's why she was like, um, uh, when she told us her name. Yeah. Because she made it up. She made up the name Meryl. Oh, so her name's not Meryl. Her name yeah. Nadia. But like, we call her Meryl. She chose the name Meryl. Got it. Yes, yes. What's happening? Uh, it's showing the descendants. Queen Lian was kidnapped, and someone was supposed to have gone and saved her, but now history's been changed! Hi, Jojo! Hello, Marin! Hello, hello, Marin! Hi, Marin. We're playing Chrono Trigger. Is good. Meryl looks so much like the Queen that they probably called off their search when she appeared. But if the real Queen is killed... Oh, shit! 
then Meryl won't have been born. It'll cause a time paradox. Oh. Great. So yeah, this is like a very, like, already pretty different what you were expecting. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. It's That's a cool. time travel RPG. And, like, you go to the future and shit, too. That's like, cool. yeah. There's a lot of, like, stuff. A lot of different stuff. So it's not just, like, oh, the medieval fantasy. It's just a time travel game. Mm -hmm. Something must happen to the queen in this era, and if she isn't rescued... Uh, someone, something must happen to the queen in this era if she isn't rescued. And if something happens to her, her descendant, Princess Nadia, will never come into being. We have to find the real queen! Now Luca joined us. We can buy her a gun later. I like Luca. Her design the is really shooter. cool. You get a pea shooter. Yeah, the penis. Uh, uh, Let me check when the ad break is supposed to start. 12 minutes. Okay. It's just important to check that way, like... I can like it doesn't just cut off. Yeah, because I do like taking breaks during the ad break because it's, it helps me. Yeah. Will you ever do a stream of Live a Live? Um, maybe if I replay it. Maybe um, maybe I'll replay it once it it's PC. Jeremy, did I, I? I remember linking it to you, but I don't know if you saw. Live a Live is coming to Steam. Oh. Okay. So I I would highly recommend it. Okay. How do I get out of the castle? I'm assuming I have to go into that forest to the left. I am to understand that you played some role in helping to rescue my lady wife. Oh, okay, cool. I love that you could just, like, yeah, it is... It, like, I've, I've really never seen an RPG where you can just, like, walk away from someone while they... Oh, wait. Mm -hmm. If I... if I 600 AD. Oh. And, um, they were talking about the Millennium Festival, so I guess we're 400 oh. years in the past? Okay, okay. Guardia Forest. You wanna try going sure. through this? Just get used to the battles. Now we got Luca. Someone left, you said? Someone left? You said I'm going left? Oh yeah, well, go south first and then left on the map. It's coming to Steam April 27th. Oh wow, that is very well, soon. Sure, but I that. That's fine. Damn, okay. Yeah, it's fine. So remember, time only stops if you're choosing tech or item. I mean, try experimenting with the techniques. They're fun. I was always really confused as a kid because I thought tech like meant technology, but it means technique. So it's basically like special moves. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oops. Sorry if you're overwhelmed by this. No, it's okay. <laughs> Kronk's level increased. Go. I guess go. My level increased. I leveled up. <laughs> yeah, th this place to the left. You see. Got it. I got it. Oh. <laughs> Hmm. Oh. We pray for the peace of our world. We are ever so devout. Tee hee hee. Alright. <laughs> yeah, he's unreally into it. That we might reclaim the future for ourselves in your name. Oh, how delicious. I mean, delightful looking you are. Um, uh, oh, great lord and master. Deliver your judgment upon the weak and undeserving. Are they evil? Is that the twist? Why not say pray for yourselves? Hee hee hee. Okay, I actually, I want to quickly leave because I realized we haven't saved the game yet and it seems like this might be a boss fight, so I'm just going to... If we're out on the overworld, that yeah. means we can save. That's just how it'd be. Oh, yeah, that was when I was testing out the game. We don't have Chrono anymore. We have Kronk. Anyway, um, yeah, it seems like there might be a boss there. I don't know. Yeah. yeah like a sparky thing. What did you find? A hairpin. Oh, it's Hey, hilarious. this is Guardia's Royal Crest. Ah, oh. uh, you were right. Yeah, they were saying hee hee hee. Cool Try looking. a tech! Cyclone. Cyclone! Her! See if you do it on her, it hits the one on to the left of her. Charming. See? Whoa! Get fucked. Yeah. Scary what does Luca have? Ghosts. She does not, not have any techs yet. You stop. Damn. Didn't do anything. Fucked up. This game, has, this game has LGBT representation because Luca gets affected by the succubus characters. Hell yes. <laughs> uh, does tech waste like magic, I guess? Yeah, it's MP. You can recover it, though. Like, there's no point in, like, not using it, you know, the point yeah, of it. Yeah. it it's, it's a hard habit to get into sometimes for me. Mm -hmm. Just like, you know. Oh, I don't want to use my MP because I might need it later, but like, yeah, you, you need it now, it. you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The fun of these games is, you know, using shit like that. What's really cool is later you get techs that like, uh, work, th that basically are like combo moves. Like, uh -huh. 
like two characters do it together and it does something like crazy. That's cool. I, at least from what I remember. Yeah. Yeah, if two characters are near each other, you might as well try Cyclone, yeah. But yeah, I just love that the battles are just in the overworld. It's really cool. Yeah. And yeah, uh, the artist for this game was Akira Toriyama, if you couldn't tell. I like it. Yeah. He made Dragon Ball and Dragon Quest. Oh. Fuck you! You fucking dick. You fucking dick! Now who's gonna fuck me? What's TP? Uh, that's, I think, tech points. Like, you can... Use those to unlock new text. Got it. Whoa, Whoa there. No! Ack. Ack. It's Frog! Oh, I forgot yeah. he's this early into the game. Lower your guard and allow the enemy in. You've come to <laughs> save the queen? The fiend's lair lies with it. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this song. Let me turn this shit up. A giant talking frog. You know I can't stand. Why? Racism. Prevails. Wait, wait. You, you don't seem like a bad frog. I mean, person. Um, what should we do, Kronk? Go with the frog. Of course. Refuse. Right. I guess I'll just have to get over my aversions to slimy, moist-skinned creatures. Oh my god! It's, I mean, he's right there. So, what's your name? <laughs> yeah, his name is Frog. All right. I kind of want to just. I mean, like. Can you think of a better name than that? No, frog. Uh, uh, X, maybe? Cool. Let me... Okay, now, yeah, accept. Is frog correct? It know. sure is. Frog is... Oh, How could frog be wrong? If frog awful. isn't... If frog is wrong, I don't want to be right. <laughs> Drew must conceal a hidden passage. Let's search every corner. I bet it's the fucking... The fucking organ. Oh. I mean, look at it. Oh my god, he's jumping. Oh my god, I love that! Oh, I love that. Chrono can play the organ. I called it. Holy shit. I literally, like, I didn't even remember that from when I played this, like, fucking ten years ago. I just, like, it was so obvious. Gargoyle. Garfield. Alright. Bring it on, you brutes. Uh, so now you got a full party of three. Uh, yeah. I, I'm assuming I don't have my fucking pecs. Cyclone. Duh. Tech. Yeah, does Frog have any? He's got uh, Slurp. Oh, it's like a it's like a vampire move. Cool. Oh, I use it on myself. Yeah. I'm assuming I wasn't supposed to do that. Uh, I'm about to die. No, no, you didn't use it on yourself. You attacked an enemy and then it healed Frog. Oh, I see. Yeah. Woo! Slurp. At least that's what I think it is. Slurp. Die. 72! Jesus. So what do you think of Chrono Trigger so far? I like it. Yeah? Yeah. I'm glad you like it. Someday I would really like to play Chrono Cross. Actually, Chrono Cross finally got re-released recently. Oh yeah? And it included a... Uh, of course you know about Satellaview because you, you have BS Legend of Zelda. Uh-huh. The re-release of Chrono Cross included a Satellaview exclusive visual novel. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was Japan only. They translated it. So that's, that's cool. really fucking cool. Um, oh, see? It's a dual tech. What is... Dual tech. Tra fire whirl. I get, yeah, Luca, Luca and Chrono have fire whirl. That's oh, really cool. Look at that. I think both of them need to like have their full bar for it to work. Okay. I, I think that's how it is. When we go into, when we're done with this fight, you should try going, oh, okay, I'll Sorry, just open it up. Something. That's fine. Kronk's level increased. Okay, cool, that actually made me want to, because I wanted to know, oh, do you fully heal when you level up? You do not, unfortunately. I like games that fully heal you when you level. Um, we do have two ethers, which restore MP. I guess I'll use it on Kronk. Um, party. Yeah, let's check the techs. 
Okay, so you don't spend them on new ones. It's just when you get this much TP, he will learn mm -hmm. the new move. Okay. That's cooler than, like, just from leveling up. Yeah, I guess I'll pick it up while you're... Okay, yeah, if you're, sorry, if my, you're texting. My, my yeah. Like yeah, that's totally fine. Store a small amount of HP to it. Oh, okay. It is a healing move. I thought it sucked out. Yeah, it's like a stuff. vampire thing. Yeah, I thought it was a vampire thing. It's not. It's just it just heals a party member. So you were right. You accidentally used it on yourself, but you should have on a party member. So that's fine. We figure it out. Look at it. Frog's big ass fist. I love him. Earn two TP. Yeah, I like that, like, each fight gives you TP rather than leveling up. I know I just said that, but yeah. I really like Frog. He's cute. Alright, okay, we were already here. How's the viewers doing today? How are you guys? Alright, these guys are nearby. Maybe I could do a Cyclone. Yeah, yeah. Let's have Frog use Slurp on Luca. I just love that his name is Frog. <laughs> okay, so Cyclone costs 2 MP. Okay, got it. 2 out of my 6. I'm just figuring out, out like, which numbers mean what. I like in certain snake things. guys. They look really cool. Yeah. Viper, huh? Okay. Oh, cool. They both is died. Is still in this chapel? Yeah. Cool. So, like, a deep cave within. Obtained American water. <laughs> Let's see what... Oh yeah, it was the Athenian water, the thing that revives. Revives a code ally. Revives code name Steam. Blech. Oh, it's a belch. <laughs> What's with the disguises? Hurry up and change. No need to be walking around like humans in here. Oh, that's so true. Ugh, it's almost time for my shift. I hate pretending to be human. They're so smelly and repulsive. <laughs> it's so demeaning. Stupid. I love shit like this. I love when you can talk to, like, bad guy NPCs in games. Mother 3 does that a lot. And Dragon Quest does mm -hmm. also. Yeah, sometimes there are slimes that you just talk to and they say, Slurp, I'm not a bad slime, I promise. I'm, <laughs> I'm goo. <laughs> That's goofy. Uh, the, the, yeah, they always make slime puns. It's adorable. Uh, those ones we ate last time weren't so bad. And those two soldiers we just caught look plump and juicy. That's my GameCube controller. Yakra is a genius. His plan to imprison the Chancellor and take his role worked like magic. Oh, I just realized the ad break probably fucking started, huh? Okay. Oh no, it's oh. actually about to start. So thirty seconds. Yeah, let's um, let's take a little break.
Hey, we're back, everybody. Hello. This is Chrono Trigger. Shift starts. Ow. Uh, yeah. Uh, I see we got uh, Sol Salt BB or Saltar. It's hard for me to read from here, but hey, welcome. How you doing? Yakra's a genius. He did a fucking funny thing. Anyway, let's continue throughout this chapel. Oh, really? A Sistine built this chapel? <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. Well, there's... There's the queen, or Nadia, or... Thought on Bowser in a jar. Weirdest question I've ever been asked. Um, pretty cool. I liked when that he said... Goofy. I said, I think he said... Donkey Kong 2! I liked when he said that while he was in the jar. <laughs> oh, how good of you to come. Thanks. I'm sure Yakura will be pleased. Please pass the time in here with us until he has a chance to come and greet you properly. Oh, you came to rescue me. Okay, <laughs> but I assure you there's no need. The master of this place, Yakura, is so very kind. I've decided to stay here. You're not the real Meryl! Did you by chance came some to save Queen Lean? Oh, you did. That's good to know. Okay, so how do I actually, like, like point out that they're not real? Oh, great Magus, Magus the Great. Your eyes are brighter than the stars. Your flowing hair the waves atop the sea. Even those miserable sunny days abate when we feel your seething hate. Even Brighton halls hold no fear, just so long as you are near. Too true. Is it Magus or Magus? I like Magus. I think Magus sounds better. Obtain speed belt. Let's equip that, huh? Power glove. Ah, no, no, no. We're gonna go to Luca. Air gun. We need the pea shooter. Yeah, but we don't have it, unfortunately. Um, what properties from Nintendo or other games you do want to see as movies? Uh, Jeremy definitely wants a Zelda. You don't movie. know what kind of TV you have. That's right. I don't know what kind of TV I have. Thank you, thank you, Eggman from Sonic. Uh, <laughs> I love that. I love these sound effects so much. Um, what other video games would I want as a movie? Um, I don't... Pikmin movie would be pretty cool. Um, though I I would want Olimar to, like, have a speaking role. And, uh, basically I would want it to be, like, like the cutscenes in Pikmin 3, where Olimar's just talking to the camera and he's just like... <laughs> and it's just captioned. Uh, but yeah, Pikmin would be cool. Um... A Kirby movie would be cool, but like also like I just want the Kirby anime to come back. Uh, I don't know. How do I how do I actually fight these guys? Oh, okay, cool. Come join us in singing your funeral dirge. Oh, Jeremy, I'm fighting the boss. You better watch on your phone. Okay, guys, I'm without Jeremy, but I'll be okay because I have him in my heart and him in my bathroom. Uh, we'll have Frog use Slurp on Chrono. Thank you, Frog. Very based. But yeah, I don't. I don't really know what I what game I would love as a movie, because a lot of games I play like aren't like super plot focused, and just like also like games are so long that like I feel like many of them would work better as like a TV series. But also like I don't really feel like adaptations are very necessary because. Games and film are very different things, and I feel like the best games are the kind that don't really translate well to film. Like, I don't know. Like, it's cool when a, a game, movie, or film comes out, but I'm never really begging for something like that. So that's my answer. If they did Kirby VA, I'd want the VAs for Kirby, Diddy, and Meta Knight to be the VAs for Meat Wad, Master Shake, and Frog Block from Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Um, I would, uh, I would prefer for Kirby not to speak, and I would, uh, very much like... DDD to be played by, I, what was his name? I, Dan Green or something. I don't I don't remember the actor who played him in the anime, but I absolutely adore DDD's voice in the anime. Just when he's like, I'm a clobber that there, Kirby. <laughs> like damn, he's so fucking iconic. I absolutely adore him. You can't go wrong with that. Killed him. All right, frog. Uh, frog attack. What about you? What kind of movies? What kind of video game movies would you want, Fleemon? Kronk's level increase. Fl Frog learns Slurp Slash. Learn to cross strike dual tech. Fuck yeah. Oh, 
I mean, another Dragon Quest movie would probably be cool, but I feel like we did get one pretty recently. I mean, it's a, like a big debate is like, I don't know, like what I want, like an adaptation of a story that's already been told in game or like a new story with those characters, you know? Because like I, what I really didn't expect from the Mario movie is uh, to, uh, t t for it to like actually like explain things that were very vague about like the, the game's story. Like it gave us the, pretty much the most concrete, like actual, like, backstory for Peach we've ever gotten, aside from, like, old comics from the 90s that are definitely less canon than this. Because, like, I think it's important to remember, Miyamoto, like, worked very closely with this movie. So, like, these are things, like, he accepted and was like, this is good, I like this. So, like, it feels like the game could, the movie, like, could be, like, like bordering canon, which I think is really cool. I want a Smash Bros. movie that would take a lot of time and effort. An e Epic Mickey would be really cool. I don't really see a Smash Bros. movie working well at all. Um, it's a fun idea, but like, I don't know. I just kind of would want Subspace Emissary again. Damn, that voice sample kind of sounds like a... Uh the Marin, or the, not Marin, Milan voice from Ocarina of Time. Hi, Marin. How you doing? Obtained hidden naga bromide, bromide, bruh. Hey, there are humans in here. Me entering any store. Get them. Flamethrower. Flame shot. That's from uh, Metal Slug. But yeah, I like that the characters, like, the enemies' positions actually make a big difference. So we got five viewers right now. Thank you, guys. Means a big amount. Just because Oswald the Lucky Rabbit should be more in the spotlight and that the Mario movie showed you could do a cool idea with Mickey Mouse. The Mario movie showed that? What do you mean? Just because, like, Mario and Mickey are, like, similar concepts, I guess. I don't know. Mickey always, like, talked and, like, did things and stuff. I don't think, uh, and I also don't think the Mario movie, like, is the first, like, good non-game piece of Mario media. I mean, I think the Mario OVA, like, is probably, debatably a better Mario movie. I don't know if you've seen the Mario OVA, but I absolutely adore it. And it is crazy that that came out in 2000, not 2000, in 1986. The Mario OVA fucking came out, uh, before, it, it came out, like, before, like, Super Mario Brothers 2. Like, a year after the first Mario game came out. Ooh, look at that flamethrower. Go through the other guy. Love that. Mm. Yeah, I love the position thing. I explained it loudly again because Jeremy walked in, so I wanted him to know. <laughs> I heard yeah, I saw that one. Uh, Peach dumped Mario for a dog voiced by Sonic. What? What is that? Voiced by Sonic? From the Sonic OVA. Oh. Yeah, a lot of people get really mad that, like, Peach, like, didn't, like... Like, Peach, like, had a fiancé in that movie, but, like... I didn't have a problem with it. I thought like it was really sweet and Mario was like disappointed for a second, but he was like, I'm happy that you're happy, Peach. And it's just like, that's really good because a lot of like damsel in distress type like fucking uh, stories, the, they, they end up like having the moral of like, cool, if you save the woman, she will marry you. And it's just like, mm -hmm. I don't know, like, well, why can't a woman just be your friend? <laughs> like, exactly. Yeah, it's just like, okay, the, the women aren't rewards to get. I'm happy, Pe like Peach is also, also Peach's husband in that, in the OVA was really cute. Like she, he like had like a little like dot nose. He was adorable. <laughs> we should, we, yeah, me, Jeremy, we really should watch the Mario OVA yeah, next time we hang out. It was, it was, it was really nice. Wow, God, that's a, that's that's a, a big lot. number. No, it just attacked both of them at once. So like it was like 15 oh. and 14, but like, oh. it, like yeah, no, it's just on top of each other. Oh no, Chrono's poisoned. I got to use my item, my I pancake. pancake. <laughs> uh, what does Slurp Slash do? St Stag an enemy with tongue, then slash it. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. Like brings them over. Wanna pick it back up? After this? Okay, cool. That's fine.
I just like experiencing a thing yeah. with you. Me too. Yeah, get him, bitch. Damn, this snake is fairly fucking tough. Never mind. I love Frog's giant <laughs> fist. Alright, now, how do I get that treasure to the left? I want it. Oh, I got it. Oh, man! I totally forgot to bring an octagon! Obtain steel saber. Ooh, new weapon? Can, uh... Oh! Chrono and Cro Frog actually have different kinds of weapons. Okay, cool. Do you remember the Mario VA where they parodied Momo Taro and Mario was gonna shoot Bowser with a gun? <laughs> what? What is Momo Taro? No idea. Okay, um... Is that a Mario, like, anime thing? Like, because I don't remember that in the Mario OVA. And I believe there's only one Mario OVA. Uh, so I don't know what you're talking about. Um, that is funny. <laughs> Marin vo M Melon voice. The oh, yeah, yeah, I never noticed that. I, it probably is the same sample. Also, I keep calling her Marin now, because now I know someone named Marin, so I talk about Marin from Zelda a lot now. <laughs> Even though, I mean, she was already, like, such a cool character. In fact, I mentioned Marin from Zelda today, uh, because she says, not very good when you play the ocarina. She makes fun of you. <laughs> yes, there's a different OVA where they use Mario characters uh, to adapt for different folktales. I have seen that. I've oh. seen that, like, uh, I didn't think of it as an OVA, because it was just, like, it just seemed like a bunch of, like, little cartoons. But yeah, there was, like, Mario, like, versions of, like, little, like, Japanese, like, fairy tales and stuff. It was silly. Gak intruders. Ah. It's Gak, Gak, Gak. All right, I have to battle these guys again, but ah! eight. Uh, combo. Rest in peace. Breaking yeah, seriously, back. rest in peace combo. Yeah. Joel just got to that part. Thank God. So oh. <laughs> we, we almost. Whoops. Split. Whoops. <laughs> Didn't realize. Uh, listen. I mean, it is true that a million fucking people our age are yeah. finally watching the show for the first time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the show is, like, a million years old, so, you know. <laughs> but, yeah, that doesn't mean, yeah. I'm just saying it's funny. Like, our, <laughs> like, why did it, like, blow up? Like, why is everyone our age watching it now? I, it's probably the memes, honestly. Yeah, I'm saying, but, like, why did those start? Uh, I guess because Better Call Saul was ending, so people got more hyped about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, but, I mean, it was, our, it was already kind of a thing before the final season of Better Call Saul came back. Yeah, I'm just yeah. saying, like, Breaking Bad, like, has always, like, persisted in meme culture, but, like, it got so huge, like, within the past, like, two years. Right. Jesse, I can't find my glasses! <laughs> just, Jesse, you brought RV with the wrong ingredient! <laughs> <laughs> Anyone get any new text yet? Uh... TP needed... Me when I run out of TP. What an original joke. I've never watched Breaking Bad, but it might be COVID. You you think like COVID like made COVID it started it COVID like made it more popular? Yeah, it could be. I don't know. If it was home watching bullshit. Yeah, I, I suppose so. I mean, like Breaking Bad was already huge. It's just like like interesting with our generation. Yeah. Yeah. Because like I remember like my whole family was really into Breaking Bad when it started. Just like I was too young. I was fourteen. Like. Mm -hmm. In fact, I, I watched the finale with them just because they were having a little party with it with, with, for it. That's cool. Uh, yeah. I remembered pretty much nothing about it, so that was cool. I mean, like, I, I knew spoilers from the show just because, like, the show persists in culture. Yeah. But, like, yeah. Uh, had pretty much no memory of that. <gasps> Sparkly spot! We can save here. I like this music a lot. Me too. But yeah, like, you can't always save, like, indoors, but you can at a sparkly spot. And, um, remember we got shelter before? What yes. a shelter does is, if you're at a sparkly spot, you can fully heal. Oh, cool, okay. Yeah. Heal the whole party, too. Yeah. Save. Select a file. Select a stage. Um, treasure. Obtain shelter. Oh, cool. No, perfect. Yeah. Uh, oh! What is this? Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, where it does that thing with the staircase ten times? Zzz, zzz. No, stop that, you idiot. I said a million times that one's just a decoy. Herg? This guy's horrifying. 
Uh, all I remember Breaking Bad, about Breaking Bad was that either it or another AMC series had a cameo from Hank Hill from King of the Hill waking up from a dream. That definitely did not happen in Breaking Bad. Uh, yo, what? I mean, no, that definitely did not happen. Breaking Bad is a very serious show. They wouldn't do that. <laughs> what? Uh, it's probably another AMC series, I guess. Yeah. And I'm assuming it wasn't The Walking Dead either. You're thinking, of, you're thinking of Family Guy. Uh, There's a Family Guy bit where that happens. Where where, how, where, how Peter, you... where Peter Griffin wakes up from a dream and he's in bed with Lois and then Hank Hill comes out of their bathroom and is like, Honey, what's that fat man doing in our bed? <laughs> how do you confuse Breaking I don't, Bad I don't, and I, Family I don't Guy? Know, I think that's what <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, I've seen that. There's also a scene in The Simpsons where, like, they're, like, at, like, a football game and then Hank Hill and, like, Luann, Bobby, and Peggy are, like, in the crowd and, and Hank's like, We drove 2,000 miles for this? And it's funny. <laughs> Ah, if I attack the middle one, I look, I attack the middle one, it attacks all three. I got it. Look at that shit. Hell yeah. Ah, uh, let me do a big slurp. Uh, let's just do a fast forward. Why not? Uh, well, it was the same show that it was revealed where it was some show that it was revealed where it was a dream by Hank Hill. So there's some show that it is canonically a dream. Uh, are you thinking of the fucking Malcolm in the Middle sketch? Where, is that a thing? I, you know I, how he was the dad in Malcolm in the Middle? Oh, uh, yeah. There's like the, that clip of, of the dad waking up and he's like, oh, I was a meth dealer. It's a, it's there like, is? Yeah, it's really dumb. Well, that's... Was that... That happened in Malcolm in the Middle? I don't know if it had... I think it was like some kind of sketch, but it wasn't... Yeah, because like cause, yeah, Malcolm happens. in the Middle like ended long before. Yeah, no, yeah. I mean, but it was like a sketch with the actors. It, it, okay, that's and, cute. Yeah. He's like, oh, I was a meth dealer and... Oh, I was a you, meth dealer. You, you, you described all the characters. I okay. sell cocaine and cocaine accessories. Yeah, uh, going back and watching Malcolm in the Middle is insane because, like, it, it like Brian Cranston is like more unhinged in that show. <laughs> like, it, like it, it, he's just like, like he's so much more cartoony because mm -hmm. that is like a very, very cartoony show. Yeah. So he's just like, do it, get in here, like. <laughs> There's that shot where, like, you've probably seen it, like, I see it in memes a lot, where and, like, looking at him in the whole screen. Yeah, he just looks at Malcolm, and then the fucking whole background just turns dark, and he's like, No, you're sure about this, you can't go back. Like, it's just... <laughs> <laughs> Where am I going? Can I joing? What does this note say? No entry within. The power yeah, within. Seems so. The power within. Also, hi, Juglius. Welcome back. What's up, Joel? We run around these. Oh! Sometimes you can. He did a big kick on fucking frog. The fucking Slurpee. I was thinking about that today. That fucking that video. video. Yeah. Video. I, I love the guy. I love the, the the dude who gets the Slurpee. Is just like, I always pay for it. What's what's wrong? Let's be <laughs> friends. Like. Let me first. Let's be friends. Let's be friends. You cannot use the double gulp cup for the fucking Slurpee. What the fuck you did? You're for gonna the, clean this motherfucker up! For the fucking Slurpee? It's just like, like, damn, if I were working in, like, like, service, I would not swear at a customer yeah, yeah, like yeah. that. Actually, I would to get fired, but, like... No way, buddy. No, <laughs> no fucking way. <laughs> no fucking way. I love that guy's attitude. Like, yeah. I, I admire him, but I just, I can safely say I would not be brave enough to do the same. Well, I mean, it's it was scripted <gasps> and there's a video that if you the, the whole there's a whole clip online and they're like they start laughing at each other afterwards <laughs> no someone compared to the mario movie to the jimmy neutron movie and the mickey mouse three musketeers movie why is that oh no they're all animated children's movies i don't know <laughs> oh no <laughs> this, this won't do <laughs> i will i i'd sooner die than accept this how dare you compare Mario to Mickey Mouse Three Musketeers? Mouse. Mario would never use a musket. This was the caption. The plots of the movies are a year too small. Wow. True. I saw this green text about how this dude like saw the Mario movie and he was just like, oh, like Pe Peach kept calling Mario small and I had to go to the bathroom to jack off. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like okay, thank you for telling me that. Uh, where do I? How 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 do I? Headway. 
How do I get in? I don't know. Okay, get in. Yeah, people be crazy. Dudes be wiling. Dudes be Dr. Wily. Wily Coyote. She wiling on my coyote to like, oh, I bet I burst this skill. Skull. Skill. I, I, I was right. Oh! You got batted. <laughs> like how he like rolled down the fucking like staircase thingy. The handrail, that's what it's called. They should rename it to the staircase thingy. They will. Now that you've they made will. It. Now that you've made it. They shall. Now that you made it a thing, they definitely will. Oh, okay, that just opens. Yeah, it, it removed the spikes. Okay. Alright. Oh. 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 Um, I think at 9.30 I might head out. <gasps> no! That's in a few minutes! 15. Yeah. But Jeremy, we haven't gotten to the cool epic part. Plus, I want to keep playing. It's just the cool epic part. I can watch you play. That's true. I guess we don't have to always co-stream this game. I'd love to watch this watch you play this. Hell yeah. You can listen to it on your ride home. Yeah, sure. Underling. Undertale. <gasps> That was so loud, I did not mean for that. <laughs> I like that movie, Undertale. The Undertale. I accidentally called it a movie. I didn't even mean to. The feature film. I just saw the word movie in the chat. Kronk's level increased. Kronk, Luca learned Hypno Wave. Let's fucking go. Obtained Iron Sword. Play the organ. I wanna equip my sword first. Make frog can do more damage now. Oh, there's a skull on the left that I missed. I should probably hit that. Hit this. Or maybe that's what it actually leads to. Probably does. I'm probably stupid. I'm saucy. Son of monkey. Cool, it made bats appear. Great. <laughs> Maybe if you kill them, it'll do something. Nah. Okay. It just was like, oh, I, I, it was probably like one of those like Zelda puzzles where you have to pull the right one or else enemies no. appear. Like those snakes in Link to the Past. You know those snakes in Link to the Past. The ropes. <laughs> I, I forgot they're called that. Ropes. Yeah. It's so that's uh, the weirdest shit. I love that. Really tall. Ropes. I'm gonna slurp Bubbles. Luca. You're gonna what? Slurp Luca. Okay. Ever heard of it? Well, now I have. Yeah. Twenty. 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 Luca. Hold on, let me go right. Oh, cool, I did it. <laughs> Alright, I bet there's a boss fight here. Probably. So that would be a good yeah, be place a good for you to... Uh, to for you to leave after the fight. Okay. Uh, bu 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 let's go. Let's use another shelter. Cause why not? And save again. Oh, just skip those fights. Yeah, you can walk around enemies. Easy. <gasps> Prepare yourself, Queen Lean. It is time for you to bid farewell to this world. <gasps> Queen Alina, triplets born. A, a throne awaits. A seer warns of a deadly. How did you get in here? I walked. Frog! Flee, your majesty, we shall dispatch this fiend. Oh yeah, this is the real queen, not oh. Meryl, my bad. I forgot. Be careful. What happened to Meryl? Why did she disappear? So they released a new episode of a Rugrats reboot, and they do an adaptation of the first movie, but instead of all the weird shenanigans in the hospital, Dill is born while the family is camping. That's pretty based. His family, his family missed his... Uh... His birth. His birth, yeah. Yeah. Like Doctor Doofenshmirtz. Yeah, exactly. Oh shit! Uh, it's no. it's the carpet mole. It's um. It looks like a mole, but uh, but also part of the floor. That's what it looks like to me. Oh, never mind. It doesn't look like a mole. It it's Yakra. My bad. Ah uh, yes, of course, Yakra. Yeah, let's use Cross Strike. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. Can I put him to sleep? Will it work? Let's try it. I bet it won't, because he's a boss. 
Grag. No, it just made him really pissed off. Oh, Henry the Winkler voiced Grandpa Boris. That's really cool. I honestly, I didn't think they would bring back Grandpa Boris because I remember they, um, uh, they like didn't end up using him later in in the original run because like people like, like people like, got like offended by like his depiction. They were saying that it was like an anti-Semitic caricature, but like I always loved Grandpa Boris because he feels like a real Jewish grandpa. He reminds me of my grandpa. <laughs> um. So yeah, uh, do, is it like a similar voice? Does he still like talk like, Hey, Tommy, my little fucking grandson, let me pick you up and fucking give you a little pain, little kiss. Like, I don't know. <laughs> hey, you little baby, I'm going to fucking kill you with a, with a gun. Or does he just sound like Henry does Winkler? He does he does he just sound like Henry Winkler, Winkler where he's like, have some more chicken, have some more pie. I know that's not Henry Winkler, but when I try to think of Henry Winkler's voice, I'm just thinking of Michael McKean. Damn. So they, they fucking whitewashed Grandpa Boris. What was the episode about? Like, like, was it... Did they do another Passover special? Because I haven't really been interested in the Rugrats reboot, but it's... I, I do like Jewish representation, and I did like Rugrats. Uh, back when it was good. What? I didn't know they were doing a reboot. Yeah, it's like CGI. It looks really ugly. And they like... They, I think they took out um, Phil and Lil's dad that I can't remember the name of. Yeah. He, he wasn't in a lot of episodes. There was an episode where Passover happened on the same day as Christmas. What? Oh. Really? There was an episode... Wait, 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 wait. It it premiered on Christmas or the episode had Passover happen during Christmas like it was in the show they were like it's Passover and Christmas yes to what I'm so confused because that actually pisses me off they could have just made it Passover and Easter literally real life Passover was happening during what the fuck Passover doesn't ha Passover was a week ago <laughs> Passover doesn't happen during Christmas what the hell why did they do that? Did they explain it? Were they like, we're in a time flux or whatever the hell? Fuck that shit. They probably didn't explain it. You Fuck that. Him. I killed him. Easy. I killed him using my Jewish rage. What? I learned wind slash. You can't laugh at me. That's Jewish rage. Don't fucking laugh at me. Why are you fucking laughing at me? Do you remember that? Uh, whoops, it was Hanukkah and Christmas happening on the same day. Oh, oh. okay. Then that's normal oh I so mean, not the same day but normal. i mean hanukkah and christmas very well can overlap yeah hanukkah has overlapped christmas well that makes a lot more sense that's fine uh so the writers aren't uh idiots uh you just made a mistake that's okay the true ch true chancellor oh well damn i wish oh, okay. it, i wish it just said true like to begin with like i wish we just knew whether or not someone is an imposter, their name just says true. I am undamaged. Very based. Me too. That's a lie. Yes, let us be on our way. My way. My way. <laughs> Make sure you're safe. Don't lose your way! What'd you say? Make sure you're safe. I gotta. So we don't lose our progress. Also, all the, uh, uh, all the VAs for the babies returned except for Kimmy. Oh. Also Chucky. Because, uh, his actress passed away. What about Jimmy? Jim. Kim and Chuck. No. I wasn't sure if Kimmy was in the reboot. Do, do, do they have any... Which one's Kimmy? She's Chucky's half... Or stepsister. Oh, from the movie. Yeah, yeah, so like they, yeah, but like they brought her like into the show after that movie. It was my presence here that endangered the queen. They brought back Nancy Cartwright to be Chucky. Yeah. Fun fact about Nancy Cartwright. She's a fucking Scientologist, apparently. Like, he uses the Bart voice to, like, recruit people. <laughs> yeah. Okay. She voices Bart Simpson also. <laughs> yeah. She's like, hey, man, Scientology's cool. Don't have a cow, man. <laughs> <laughs> At least I've heard that. I actually haven't Googled that, so maybe I... <laughs> maybe that was maybe a rumor or something. True. But I don't fucking care. She's, she's fine. I mean, like, well, it's, it's, so it's fine for me to... Like, she's well off. Like, I don't care. Like, I can damage her character. Who cares? She's rich. She's been working on The Simpsons for 30 fucking years. Man, fuck rich people. Yeah. I would. Yeah, I would too. Yeah. My chocolate? Oh, chocolate. 
Uh, I'll, I'll try one. I haven't had it. Really? Also, they had Kimmy shown before Dill, and now she's as old as Angelica. They aged Susie down one age. Oh shit! Wait, wait, wait. Pause. You have never tried the, not the ball version. Oh, okay. I dropped one. I didn't realize it was the ball version. Then yes, I I, I like. Um. What? If you have like a handful of popcorn and a handful of this stuff and you eat it, it's really good. Oh hell yeah. So I guess I'll continue the stream for a bit, but you're heading out. Yeah, I'm gonna head out. All right. I'll. You know, I'll do a little ad break real quick, uh, cause Luca is dead and I want to see Jeremy off. So we will be back in three minutes. Okay. Hey, we're back. We're back, baby. We're back, baby. Thank you uh, to all my people who are still watching. Uh, the Oh, what, uh, the replacement VA for Kimmy is the same VA as D.Va from Overwatch. Oh, interesting. Does she say nerf this? Does she nerf? Does she say it's nerf or nothing? Anyway, um, we're back to Chrono Trigger. I just realized this game does a good thing I really like in RPGs, which is uh, when a character dies in battle, 
they are actually revived with one HP after the battle is over, which is 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 good. I like it. Anyway, we are actually out of. Uh... Wait, where's Frog? Does Frog leave the party after that? I must have missed something. Also, I forgot to mention the reboot is entirely CGI. No, I, I yeah, I've I've seen I've seen what it looks like. I was yeah, I don't know if you heard. I was telling Jeremy about it before he left. I was just like, yeah, it's really ugly. <laughs> um, yeah, I pretty much have no desire to watch it. Plus, it's on a streaming service I don't have and do not want to spend money on. So, it's it's pretty much uh, just it's a moot point. <laughs> And I guess actually since uh, I'm the one primarily playing, I will change the battle speed to be a little higher. Because I can, I can handle it. I'll be okay. Oh, I love this music. I have Paramount Plus through Walmart. Oh, interesting. I don't know if my parents have like a Walmart account, but if they do, that'd be cool to take advantage of that. Let's go back to this market. Get some, get some shit for Luca. Well, yeah, Luca could definitely use a pea shooter. Padded vest, no. Oh, but they can both use Broaden's helms. Let's buy two of those. Um, let's buy like a fuck ton of potions. Like it's, it's barely any money. Why not, right? Let's buy two shelters. Uh, two panaceas, Athenian water. Oh, we have seven of them. Jeez. Okay. Um, and let's equip stuff for our boys. Cool. And I guess sell the old equipment. Cool. My things do come again. Truce in. Hey, where, where should we go back? Is there a way to like see like, oh, what happened lately? Because I kind of missed out. Oh, I should probably go back to the fucking castle now that I saved the princess. Wait. Did I do that? No, I wasn't in the Gaudia part. Uh, I don't actually remember fucking anything. I may be stupid. I'm just gonna fast forward through these battles. I can probably take them just by doing that. Oh yeah, I didn't actually heal Luca. In fact, let me go back to that inn, and then we'll go back to, like, the origin point of this place, because it might be where we're supposed to go. I don't, I don't fucking remember. <clears throat> to all my funny viewers, thank you for viewing. Very funny. Oh shit! Ball rollers. Nice. 10 EXP. 80 G. I saw there was an item here, but it seems to be gone. What a shame. Damn, there are random encounters. I was lied to. I always was like... I mean, like, I wasn't lied to, but, like, I always thought to myself, like, yeah, the game doesn't have random encounters. The enemies are on the field, but, like, I guess it kind of does have random encounters, but just, like, in a cool way. Where that you actually like they you're ambushed. It makes sense. Anyway, let's go to that inn. Luca's over <laughs> Luca's map sprite looks kinda of fucking weird, at least from the side here. Uh yeah, let's go to this inn. One Krabby Patty in one room with cheese. What's that to the right? Is that a treasure? This box has been handed out for generations. Should you somehow manage to open it, you are welcome to the contents. The mysterious force seals it shut. That is very interesting. Yeah, I'd be excited to play this more. I, like, really have not touched this game for a very long time. It seems she was spouting nonsensical things like a woman possessed when they found her. Uh, I don't know what happened, but the trauma must have taken its toll. Too true. Yeah. The air be wiggly in 600 AD. Alright. I'll go back to the beginning here, because I don't remember where to go. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, evidently not here. Let's... We'll first go to that cathedral, just because, like, it's easier to get to, and then we will go back to the castle. Because I don't remember things. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry.
Okay, let's go to the castle. That's got to be where we go. Though possibly the bridge. Maybe the bridge was repaired. Probably not. Okay, cool. It was not. Let's go to the castle through the Guardia Forest. Ah! It scared me. Doo -doo. Oh yeah, forgot I'm fast-forwarding. Nah, that's fine for these battles. That's what fast-forwarding is for. Battles that are really easy. How you guys doing? How's everybody doing today? Hey, hey, hey. How are you today? I'm okay. See, we got five viewers. That is, that is really, really cool. Thank you, guys. You are always very cool to have uh, here. Love you guys. Love you fuckers. All right, Guardia Castle. Let's go see the queen. Hey, there she is. I am forever in your debt. Who knows what, what would have happened to me had you come a, even a little later than you did. By the way, what became of the girl who was mistaken for me? Good question. Oh yeah, I forgot all about Princess Nadia. I didn't. Uh, Kronk, where did the princess disappear? Uh, she may be there now. Oh, like, I can go back to the same spot she disappeared from? Cool. Was there treasure down there? 100 gold, hell yeah. <laughs> Yeah, let me in there, thanks. Yeah, more treasure, thank you. Bronze armor. Is that something I can benefit from? Uh, whoop. Yes, it is. Cool. Uh, Fiend was posing, posing as the Chancellor? That's crazy. My god. Oh yeah, I can't open that. Neither. Um, it's the other staircase, I guess. My bad. The one to the right. Sponge, Sponge Tron voice. Try the one on the right. Oh yeah, that one's the can opener. Try the one on the right. Wow, right, was she back? Oh shit! She has returned. It's Meryl. Hi, Meryl. Oh, what happened? Princess Nadia. Kronk. <laughs> it was awful. I was so afraid. I couldn't see or feel anything, but I knew I was someplace cold. I wonder if, if that's what it's like to die. Holy shit. Your Highness, I... You came to help me too. Wait, Your Highness? Uh-oh. I guess you guys figured me out, huh? Sorry, Kronk. I didn't mean to trick you. My name is really Nadia. My father is King Guardia the 33rd. I just wanted to go to the fair and have fun like everyone else, but if you'd known who I really was, you wouldn't have shown me around the fair, would you, Kronk? Probably not. See? And I like Meryl better than your highness anyway. The real queen's safe, right? Let's go home, Kronk. Cool. Now we can go back to the present. The presentation. Bye bye, bye everybody, bye. Do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty. Oh, little guy. The enemy dropped a shelter. Thank God. <laughs> Just a whole fucking house. We got Meryl back, finally. Damn, she has a crossbow? That's cool. Didn't realize that. Yeah! I like her victory pose. Meryl's funny. I like her. Do, 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 do. Boop, 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 boop. In fact, can we get any good equipment for Meryl? Now that we have her? Is there, like, a weapon she can use? No, but she can use the padded vest and a bronze helm and the bronze kneecap. Uh, 
Mm. Yeah, we'll keep the current accessory she has. <clears throat> and we'll walk around these fuckers again. My face hurts again. <laughs> ah! Marge, my face hurts again. Marge! <laughs> I love his ooh Chrono's face. The three TP, fifty nine G, ether. Uh, potion. Cool. I got a lot of shit. Potion. Potion. Whoa! It's the blue orb. So how do we get home? Well, your highness, we. Please call me Meryl. Well then, Meryl, observe. What is that thing? Luca, you're amazing. He he he. Sorry, I should be more humble in front of... Enough already. I'm a princess, but what's that mean? I can't do anything special. But you, you're incredible. I'd trade my name for your genius in a heartbeat. Well, if you say so. Anyway, I call these distortions gates. They're basically portals to the same location in a different time. The gates are unstable, that's why they appear and disappear all the time. So I use the principle behind my telepod device to create this gate key. That's what's locking the gate in place. But why did this gate suddenly appear in the first place? Either the telepod had something to do with it, or something else made it. That's interesting, something else. Oh, this is starting to sound complicated, why don't we just head back to our own time for now? Alright, come in, Kronk. Earthbound, earthbound, earth, earth, earthbound. Okay, now we're back in the present. Yay, woo, yeah, woohoo, yeah. Woo, 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 yeah. Phew, we made it. Kronk, Luca, why don't you come back with me to the castle? It would give me a chance to thank you properly for everything. I'm really sorry for putting you through all this, Meryl. What are you talking about? It was the most fun I've had in months. And I made new friends, too. Aw. Kronk, be a gentleman and take her home. I still need to do a little more snooping -ish into why that gate appeared. See you again soon, Luca. Damn, I love this freaking game. Well, Kronk, are you ready to escort me home? Yes, I am. Damn, the Guardia Forest, but now we're uh, several hundred years later. Isn't that cool? Time travel is cool. This is like the Sonic CD of RPGs. Except it's better than Sonic CD. Uh, and by better, I actually mean Sonic CD is better than this. I misspoke. My bad. <laughs> Chancellor, are you alright? What there, there have you been? You heard you were abducted. Haha. <laughs> Oomph, you're back there. You're the one, are you? Thought you'd kidnap the princess. No, Kronk only. Oh, yeah. Silly sees the filthy terrorist. Deceived our princess and plotted to overthrow the crown. This is actually the part I wanted uh, Jeremy to see, so... Jeremy, I hope you're watching. The trial is very interesting. <laughs> Meryl's fucking face. Stop this right now! What are you fools doing? What her highness the princess said. I don't give a shit. Seize him. Kronk. <laughs> wow, this background's really pretty. I never really noticed. Yeah, you have to go on trial. I like this part a lot. I, your chancellor, shall serve as prosecutor. I, Pierre, represent the defense. Members of the court, I will now bring forth the defendant, Kronk, who is charged with the abduction of Princess Nadia. What shall be his fate? To burn at the stake, perhaps? To feel the tickler? Or hang upside down? Or shall we employ the guillotine? That'd be cool, I guess. The choice is yours, good jurors. Now let us begin. We shall first hear the testimony of the defense. 
Kronk is charged with premeditated abduction of royalty. The question is, how could he be guilty of a crime that never occurred? The prosecution would have you believe that the defendant kidnapped the princess. However, the truth is quite to the contrary. Not only was their meeting a coincidence, but it was the princess herself who asked Kronk if she could join him. Is this true? Who was responsible for initiating contact? Uh, Meryl was. Are you so certain? Our witnesses say that you were the one who bumped into the princess. Oof. That's true. Ouch. Having subdued the princess, the defendant then coerced her into visiting Luca's little sideshow. There were countless witnesses to this. Oh, were you not able to hear? Hmm. Did Rami die? Uh, yes, he did. Shortly thereafter, both the princess and the defendant vanished. If that is not criminal abduction, I don't know what is. Several other acts have also been brought to my attention that call the defense defendant's character into question. Objection! This cannot possibly have any relevance to the case. Care to respond, Chancellor? Kronk's character is at the very core of this case, Your Honor. This evidence will show that his testimony cannot be trusted. Very well. We have nothing to hide. The defendant's cold-hearted nature is irrefutable. You remember this child, don't you? A poor little girl who'd lost her cat. You wouldn't even listen to her cries. I remember. You ignored me. There, there, you poor little dear. I know it must be a painful memory to recall. You may r run along now. I think the people have seen enough. The real issue here is motive. Was there any motive for this good youth to kidnap the Princess Nadia? No, there was none. Pardon me, but I believe the motive was quite clear. Greed. Her fortune did tempt you, did it not, Kronk? No. Are you sure? You weren't in the least bit tempted? Not at all. Good people, please remember that the defendant claims he had no interest whatsoever whatsoever in the princess's wealth. Allow me to introduce our next witness. I saw it with my own eyes. Dear me, I'm so nervous. That man grabbed the pendant right after he bumped into the princess, before he even checked to see if she was okay. I genuinely do adore this part of the game because, yeah, you played the game as if it was a game, and they're treating you like, wow, you didn't see her as a human. You were treating her like shit. It's kind of like Undertale in a way. Uh, and yeah, I just like very meta things like that that are like, you did this, so now we're bringing it back to bite you. Cool. It's a family heirloom, and it's very important to me. May I please have it back? It's true. Jeremy immediately refused. Jeremy said no. I heard it from the princess's own lips, as clear as could be. Hey, there's no need to drag me by the arm like a kidnapper. It's true. Jeremy didn't wait for the for her to pick out candy. Is that all? Can I go now? Goodbye, everyone. So yeah, this is just a very cool part of the game, where your actions at the fair actually have relevance here. This is why I want Jeremy to stay. Uh, that's okay. You can watch the VOD. Members of the jury, it is time for a verdict. If you believe the defendant guilty, stand to the left, innocent to the right. Not guilty. Hey, thanks, man. Guilty. Hey, Packy! Thank you for the follow. Murder. Guilty. Oh, no. Who's your little character? I can't tell who that is. It might be a Dragon Quest guy. Yeah, you can change which little character you have walking around. Oh shit, the jury thinks I'm guilty AF. Guilty- oh shit. I'll fucking do it again. Thanks. Not guilty. Yay. Yay, I'm not guilty apparently. Guilty. Order in the court. A verdict has been reached. 
I don't think this jury is fair because these guys are clearly all related. I think they're like septuplets. Uh, take him away. Bake him away, toys. Stop! Princess Nadia. Why does uh, the judge look like a Game Boy sprite? He like doesn't have enough colors. That's quite enough, young lady. Guilty of too much drip. Damn, telling it like it is. All I asked was for you to remain at the castle and behave like a princess. What's done is done. Even royalty must obey the laws of the land. Leave the rest up to the chancellor and forget about your little escapade in town. We are through here. Kronk. Whoa, that's a cool shot. I forgot how many cool shots are in this game. And it kind of reminds me of Undertale also. Because it wasn't top down. This man is a seditionist who meant to overthrow our kingdom. He has been found guilty by trial. I trust him to your care. Damn, he kicked me. So this is the monster who abducted the princess. His execution is three days hence. See that he is still here to attend it. Yes, sir. Guards. Take the prisoner away. Ow! Oh, okay, I see why you said Miku. It's because you're Miku now. Congratulations, Julius. Now I can save. Wasn't that cool how I went to jail? HP and MP restored, hell yeah. Damn, they give you a coffee in jail? That's awesome. Pipe down, you. I love the parts in games where you just are in a prison and you just have to like walk around constantly until someone lets you out. Like, what do I do? Twilight Princess does it, fucking... <laughs> <laughs> He's like, open the door, I'm gonna beat him up. Yeah, Twilight Princess, Mother 3, uh, I don't remember. Other games. It's just, oh, uh, uh, yeah, uh, Wind Waker also does it as well. That's what you get for not doing what you're told. I kill him. Really that easy? What a loser. Oh shit! Die. Hey, how you guys doing? How you doing, Packy? How you doing, Juglius? Wow, it, it, the door opened. Why won't... Why is it only open halfway? Why can't I go in? Why? Why? Mother Burns! Why? My tummy hurts, so I'm vibing at home. Oh, I'm sorry, Pecky. Actually, um, it is pretty late here, and I did get to the port point of the game that I wanted to. So I think I am, unfortunately, going to call it quits. I am sorry uh, so close to when you're coming here, Pecky. But I will probably stream tomorrow, and I would love to have you here. Uh, for now, let's see if there's someone we could raid. Because uh, it's always fun to raid people. Uh, it would be cool, I guess. Uh, I like raiding channels. Uh, who, who's this? Bravo and Go? Who is that? Well, this person's doing break right now. Let's see, um, all Gucci. Homie, I'll see you tomorrow. Hell yeah. Let me see if there's anyone playing Wario Land. Anyone playing Wario Land? No one on Twitch is playing Wario Land. What about Wario Wear, huh? Oh, cool. We got uh we got two people playing Wario Wear. Uh Okay, this this guy's at the end of his stream. Really no no Wario stuff? Come on. What about Chibi Robo? Anyone playing Chibi Robo? God damn. This is very pathetic. Why is why is no one playing cool games? Come on. What about Dragon Quest? I'm sure there's someone in Japan playing Dragon Quest. It's probably daytime over there. Um, yeah, let's uh, have this this random Japanese streamer that I don't I can't read the name of. 
Uh, they're playing Dragon Quest Heroes too. Let's raid them.